that's enough of that. Now that's enough of that. <laughs> I'm not sure it works like that. Something very scary is happening. Yeah, there's a huge spider that just came out. <gasps> Don't like flick it towards me. Oh my God, Tom. I'm Charlie and this is my husband, Tom, AKA Pocket and Dundee. After five years of adventures around the world, I finally emigrated to Australia in early 2020. We got married and then like many people, found ourselves having to change our whole lifestyle. So we're now adapting the best we can. We started a new business, moved to the Australian South Coast, and just to up the stakes even more, we're now expecting our first child. Make sure you're subscribed to follow us on this crazy adventure. Good morning, Australia. It's about seven in the morning. It is so fresh. Ah, oh, it's so nice out here, but it's about to get stinking hot. Just gonna enjoy an hour of coolness before it gets late and 37 degrees and we can't go outside. Before it gets too hot, I'm trying to just get a bit of the garden sorted. Look how well our veggie garden is doing. It's very bright. <laughs> this is all silver beet. Even our capsicums are coming up now, these two. Cherry tomatoes are taking over the whole joint. <laughs> if you've been watching these updates regularly, you'll know that in this bed along here, we planted some zucchinis. That's a courgette in the UK. Um, and leeks. And look, that is our first one. It's coming up. One zucchini. Ooh, you've done what, Tommy Roo? Is pulling the flowers off the basil to stop it from going to seed. If you pull off the flower, does it? This makes it grow rather than flower and go to seed. Got you. Now our kitchen smells all basil -y. I was totally going to do that. Oh. But you can carry on because you're going to be faster at it. Well, maybe, maybe not. I use a smaller knife to start. You're going to hate watching me do this. Just bear with me. And then, it's not ideal. It's not, I knew, that's what I meant, is I knew you were going to hate watching me do this. And then I just go down the middle with two little scores like that. Then you can just go chop and chuck it in the box and it's done. Ta da! Yeah, like that. One, two, and then you just go chop, 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 chop. And dump it in there. Boom, done. That is very yummy. Can I put this here? <laughs> I'm cutting off your head again. <laughs> Failing at filming. There we go. I look really short now. Mmm. That was a really good melon. It's really um, perfectly ripe, just sweet enough. So happy Monday, everybody. Oh, this is your Monday. It is, this is Monday. I mean, for us, it's Saturday, but you know. Um, I'm thinking of changing things up this week. I'm thinking that I'm gonna try doing maybe Monday, Wednesday, and Friday uploads instead of every day. Because as you guys might have seen if you've been following this, it's been getting a bit overwhelming and I think it's a bit too much. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just trying to work it out. So we're just gonna mix it up a bit. See what works until we find a pattern, a routine that works, if that makes sense. Today I am 27 weeks pregnant. The, on this app, um, you can switch it so that the example of how big the baby is, instead of doing fruit and veg, because that's really quite dull, I have switched it to film props. <laughs> so last week it was the magic lamp from Aladdin. And this week it is the hamburger phone from Juno, as you can see. <laughs> it's pretty, I think that's pretty fun, right? <laughs> but look how big the bump is. Ta-da! She's a growing. Mm. 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 
Your hands still smell like fish. Yeah, that's... Yeah, they do. Petrol and fish. <laughs> Tom caught loads of tuna. Yes, was it yesterday? Yeah. It was yesterday, wasn't it? I filmed it on my phone, so I'll drop in a little clip. Um, yeah, he caught lots of tuna, so we're gonna... I wish I could have sashimi, that'd be so nice. But unfortunately, you're not allowed that when you're pregnant, so... <laughs> won't be eating any of that. Mm. Show the people some tuna steaks. Mm. Let me show you. Wow. Bluefin tuna. That's some serious tuna, hey? There's another bag in there. It's bluefin, is it? Yeah. Nice work, Tommy Roo. <laughs> Keeping... Living the dream. Living the dream. Well, you know, the dream is getting fresh fish. I mean, it doesn't get much better than that, right? <laughs> Just wish you could eat it. Yeah. Wish I could eat it raw, hey? Mm. My breakfast. <laughs> Tom's breakfast. What is this toast with anchovy oil? Yeah. You crazy person. Saturday. Saturday morning craziness and then we're uh, we're finishing off snakes on a plane because you know why not. Oh we've got to deconstruct the nest though because you know the best line in the movie is coming up. I have had it with these mother snakes on this mother plane. What's that? Cockle train. Is that that's the goggle drain. Goggle drain. Goggle drain. Where should we put the paddling pool? Where? Here, I reckon. We're just like here, well, in this little shady bit I here. I don't want it in the shade because you want to warm up in the morning. Yeah. You know, so maybe it's like just like there. Because when we can dump it out on that area. We just need to dump it on a patch that needs a bit of water, right? Yeah. Let's fill up the paddling pool. Oh yeah, we need the adapter. Yeah, the paddling pool filler. The paddling pool filler. Honestly, this pool is amazing. We got this pool from Big W for about 10 bucks. No, sorry, not 10 bucks, 30 bucks, right? 30 bucks. 30 bucks, and honestly, it's like the best thing ever. It's so cool, because it's kind of deep enough to like cool off. Goggle drain! Goggles, goggles, goggles! Mm -hmm. Okay, whoa. Okay, I can't, well, where is it? I can't get, there's a huge spider that just came out. <gasps> Don't like flick it towards me. Oh my God, Tom, what type of spider is it? It's a black house spider, darling. It's huge. It's not a bad one. Okay, let me get a close up of it. Hold on. You see its web tracking out of its bum? No, I can't really. I'm trying to film it and. Ugh. Coming right for you! No, I don't <laughs> like it. That's a coil. That's a really big spider. Oh my god, that would have really freaked me out. I can't. That's what, um. What they called funnel web spiders look like, but not as. Like funnel webs are way more chunky. Okay. They're the same family, but these ones aren't dangerous. And funnel, funnel webs are dangerous and that yeah. one's not. This takes about half an hour to fill up. So let's do the uh, cool kids trick. And done. It's pretty deep for a, like, a little paddling pool. Do you know what is cool about our garden is we have this thing here, which is kind of waste recycling so all of the water that goes through the house through you know down the sink the washing machine anything for the shower everything gets treated and goes straight onto the garden which is great look see right here we've got a little thing watering watering the garden and behind us here so nothing gets wasted here in Australia it's a really good system actually what is it with the spiders today there's spiders bloody everywhere. I think it's just a house one, I don't know though. Oh no, Tom, I think this one's the dangerous one. Tommy Roo, I think this one's dangerous. I think it's one of those, one of those white tips. I don't know, but it's a weird shape. I'm nearly zoomed in. Why are we zoomed in? Let's zoom out, there we go. I don't like it. I'm trying to learn which ones are the dangerous spiders and which ones aren't, but it's really difficult. So what you said, because it's really hot weather, it's gonna, all the yeah, spiders. All, like moving around to get into a cool spot. Oh great. It's gonna be hot. Great. Can you have a look, Tommy Roo, and see if you think it's a dangerous one, please? Where is it? It's here. I think no, it's it, just a black spider. It's just a black one. He, he's moving faster and faster into our house though. Help! It's a male version of the same spider. Oh, so the males are smaller? Their bodies are smaller, yeah. Great. Oh, it smells like basil through here. 
Yeah, chopped up the basil. Oh, you chopped up the basil. So it smells like basil. <laughs> oh, it smells amazing. Well done, Rue. Delicious. We are having a proper chilled Saturday. It is so refreshing. Um, Tom's auntie is about to turn up pretty soon. Auntie Trish, who if you've watched some videos on this channel, you would have seen, if you watched the Christmas special, you would have seen her making Christmas pudding. That was quite good fun, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, but I think it's, it's just getting really sticky outside, so we're now just avoiding. I really want to start a jigsaw puzzle. I think we should do that, Tom. Can we start a jigsaw puzzle, please? Just tip the tablecloth off the table and uh, dump it out. <laughs> and start. <laughs> Simple as that, you just gotta start. <laughs> this is the jigsaw we're going to attempt. 2,000. I've never done a 2,000 piece before. Also, it's kind of ironic. It's like winter. Oh, and it's so hot outside. Oh my god, it's going to be a really big puzzle time. I'm not sure about this. I don't even know where to start. We might have got ourselves into a little bit of a pickle here. This jigsaw is way bigger than I thought. These are all the edge pieces we've just pulled out. Um, I don't really know what we're going to do. So is this bit here what you could use for sashimi? Yeah. That'd be really good. Oh yeah. Something very scary is happening. Isn't that? Because it's got a... We're making the cot. We're putting the cot together. Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness me. A little bit more. Yeah, a little bit more. Come over there. <laughs> Find the hole. Um, it's a good job we've got Tom putting yeah. this together. Is that like something happened? I think so. I'm not sure about the bottom one. It's alright? Yeah. It's in the vicinity. Yeah, that's in. <laughs> Next scary step of the day. We've done the cot. Now we're going to practice putting the baby wrap on. We've got a tutorial video. Let's see how well this goes. Obviously you don't normally have a huge bump when you do this, but... Put the baby in. Put the baby in. Wrap it around the, the legs aren't going to poke out. <laughs> Our baby isn't quite like this is going to fit. The back bend needs. <laughs> <laughs> baby put it out. Baby in. Baby in. I don't think you meant to grab the scrub the neck. This is a door stop. It's a pretty weighty door stop. <laughs> Deary me. Okay, well, that was interesting. Is Tom, is Tom going to have a go? Here yeah, we go. yeah. Wait, wait. Oh, look at him! Look at him! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that does make it feel more comfy. Baby can breathe. Oh, look at this! Alright, that's enough of that. Oh, that's enough of that. I'm not sure it works like that. It's Saturday night, which means homemade pizza night! Tom loves to have barbecue sauce base on his, whereas I like pizza sauce. And then we've got toppings. I'm definitely going for mushroom. Yeah, mushrooms. And uh, I'm allowed to have ham as long as it's cooked. Yay! <laughs> and we got pineapple. We got Shredded. we got all, and we got mozzarella. We got all the toppings. I'm so excited. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed our random hanging out with us on a Saturday. 
please subscribe, please hit the like button and drop me a comment, talk to me because if you don't talk to me, I don't really, I don't know who you are, you're watching it and I have no idea, it's just viewing numbers and it means absolutely nothing to me. So if you don't, drop me a comment and say hello. <laughs> um, Tom, have you got anything to add? <laughs> he's just, oh, he's just putting some basil on um, our pizza. He's trying to pick out the nice leaves. Um, <laughs> Uh, no. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> That's what he always says. Also, I had to get into my pajamas because I spilled sauce all over my dress. See you on. Oh, I don't even know. This see you week. Later when you're late, <laughs> this week it's going to be. Uh, see you on Wednesday.